Hey, what's up? Jigs are here. Are you getting a verification required error message when you try to install or purchase an application on your iPhone? In this video, I will walk you through the steps to fix this problem and get you back to installing the apps you need. Let's go. Often the verification required message appears due to an issue with your Apple ID payment method. This could be because you don't have a payment method associated with your account you have insufficient funds, or have unpaid balances. Without a valid payment method, you won't be able to make purchases, download free apps, or even use subscriptions on your Apple devices. To enroll or add a payment method to your Apple ID, open the Settings app. Click your name above, and navigate to the Payment and Shipping configuration page. Tap on Add Payment Method, and choose your preferred payment type from the list provided. Keep in mind that the options available to you may vary depending on your country or region. After selecting your payment method, carefully enter the required information, such as your account number, name, or card details. Make sure to provide a valid billing address, including your street name, zip code, city, country, and phone number. Finally, tap Done to save your changes and ensure that your payment information is updated. If you have an existing payment method and receive an error message indicating insufficient funds or other issues, simply click Add Payment Method again and follow the same steps I discussed earlier to register a new one. In case you already added multiple accounts, the first one listed will be your primary payment method. To change this, click Edit in the upper right corner and drag your preferred payment method to the top of the list. In addition, note that if you're part of a family sharing group with purchase sharing enabled, only the family organizer can manage the payment method. Therefore, if you're facing payment issues, contacting the family organizer to update their payment details will resolve the problem for everyone in the group. In case the issue persists, consider contacting Apple support for more specific guidance regarding your concern. To find the appropriate contact options, visit the Apple Support website at getsupport.apple.com slash topics. Choose App Store and go to the Subscriptions and Purchases section. There you can select the subtopic Unable to Purchase or describe your issue in your own words. After clicking Continue, you'll have the choice to either speak with a support representative over the phone or engage in a live chat. Okay, if I've been able to assist you, I would really appreciate it if you could leave a thumbs up and subscribe. And if you enjoy taking photos and videos with your iPhone, please visit my website. Over the last few months, I've created a video course where I've gathered the best tips and tricks on how to make the most out of your iPhone for photography. You'll find the link to the website in the video description. Until next time, bye.